there was a party-like atmosphere at Taipa Racecourse in Macau, as locals bade farewell to 44 years of thoroughbred racing in the former Portuguese colony. 14 races were scheduled for the day's program, with a mix of turf and dirt surfaces. Among those in the audience was Mr. Ip, who was excited to witness this historical moment. He admitted horse racing has lost its attractiveness as there are plenty of entertainment options these days. Mr. Chan, a long-time horse racing fan, was one of those who witnessed the opening of Taipa Racecourse in 1989. Showing off a souvenir, he recalled the fond memories of his soon-to-be old times. The Macau Jockey Club only had its racing license extended by 24 years in 2018. But the permit was abruptly revoked in January with the government saying that raising activities could not generate economic and social benefits. The club has been under financial trouble, accumulating debt of over 2.5 billion patakas. Around 570 employees, including trainers and stable staff, would be laid off. 300 or so horses will be relocated overseas over the next 12 months, while the premises will be vacated and returned to the government. The SAR government has already stated that the land on which the race course sits will be rezoned for other purposes. Janice Yu, Cable News.